JBN, we keep you informed. I am Michelle Jones, and in the news, men killed in separate shooting incidents in Manchester identified. Please remember to subscribe, share, leave us a comment, and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items. Two men were killed during separate shooting incidents in Manchester on Sunday. Police named one of the deceased as 45-year-old Orville Bell, a resident of Yorktown in Clarendon. Friends and associates named the other man as 26-year-old Javel Dias, otherwise called Gaza. In the first incident, a report from the Constabulary Communications Unit said about 3.30 a.m., residents of Confidence Avenue in Mandeville heard loud explosions and called the police. The police said on their arrival, Bell was found suffering from multiple gunshot wounds. He was taken to hospital where he was pronounced dead. In the second incident, sources say sometime Sunday afternoon, Dias was at his family home in Barnstaple when he was awoken from his sleep and called outside the house by men who drove up in a grey motor vehicle. Sources say Dias took his son outside with him but then returned inside the house with the toddler. He was instructed to put the child down. It is further reported that he then returned outside and was shot in the head. He was taken to the Mandeville Regional Hospital where he later succumbed to his injuries. Police investigations are underway. Man killed. Woman assaulted during St. Elizabeth home invasion. A man was killed and another shot and injured and a woman sexually assaulted during a robbery in Nemar Town, St. Elizabeth on Sunday, March 20. The deceased has been identified as 29-year-old Jermaine Green, otherwise called Jimbo, a farm of Nemar Town. Reports from the Junction Police are that about 8.15 p.m., armed men invaded the family's home and demanded cash and cellular phones. A struggle ensued between Green and one of the gunmen, during which he was shot. A male family member was also shot and injured. A woman was also sexually assaulted during the ordeal. The robbers escaped with cellular phones and an undetermined sum of cash. The police were summoned and the injured people were taken to hospital, where Green was pronounced dead on arrival. The injured man and woman are being treated. JBN, we keep you informed. Please remember to subscribe, like, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items.